bisogna stare attenti what is this stuff it was like 55 degrees here the other day can't believe this weather but I wanted to bring you guys a quick update there's a lot going on today with the uh, with the uh, market and um, wanted to give you guys an update on everything that I normally do tonight uh, no edits crypto Episode number 44. I'm sitting here watching the Champions League as I do a little bit of work, but um, Juventus and uh, Tottenham Hotspur are on today. But for the soccer, the soccer fans out there, the people that know that I like soccer, um, probably my favorite sport, that and hockey. But I wanted to give you guys a quick update if I get this set up here. Make a little desk. The uh, price has fallen in the last uh, 36 hours for Bitcoin. It's dropped down below $10,000 again. And uh, that's about a $1,000 correction in the last 36 hours now. So there's some people a little bit concerned about that. Some people saying that we're heading below 6000 as many thought before. Others thinking that this is just kind of more sideways action. That, you know, excuse me, that the price... Um, it, you know, we saw we saw some build up there, and then now we're seeing another correction or whatever. So um, a lot of people think we're just going sideways, and that it's just kind of working itself out before it heads back up. But um, personally, I, w I think that um, we're down 8.43 percent today. It's at 9,800 dollars, 9,883 USD. Um, it's really hard to tell what's going on. I still think that the overall graph looks pretty good, but um, we're going to have to wait and see. Ethereum is really taking a shot too. It's down, I mean everything's down quite a bit, 8 or 9% today, but Ethereum's dipped below $800 now and is below $750. It's at $743.14 right now, down 8.33% uh, for the day. Uh, Litecoin also taking a major blow, down 6.41% at $182. Um, Probably still a good time to buy Litecoin, and you know this isn't advice, financial advice. But I would, I still, I want to stack as many Litecoin as I can before I think it's gonna, you know, reach really uh, take off parabolically um, in the next few months. You know, I'd like to be holding as many of those as I can be while before that happens, uh, leading up to that ascent. But um, Neo for the day is at. Um, Neo has dropped below $100 officially, it's, but it's the only it, it's down 5.59% for the day. The last 24 hours is green though, up 0.91%, and it's at $99, just below $100, $99.08 right now. Um, also, not not performing very well. And then lastly, um, Steam has dropped below $3. It's at $2.81, down 13.11% for the day. So. A lot of uh, a lot of red out there today, and um, we're gonna have to see what happens here in the um, next uh, next few hours. Here's the is the uh, workday winds down. It's be interesting to see if we continue down or if the the bleeding stops or not. You know, but um, I really hope we don't head back down below you know ninety three hundred dollars per Bitcoin. That would be a little depressing because then you could see maybe it, we would be hit, heading a lot lower. But right now I'm not too concerned. We'll see. That $500 to me means a lot for some reason. I think there's like some psych, some sort of psychological bound there. But um, I'm gonna. I just wanted to bring you guys a market update. I might bring some more news tonight, like I do the typical stories. But um, I just wanted to get the uh, get a quick. Uh, market update out because uh, a lot of people were freaking out as always I wouldn't go and sell my stock or my bag empty my bag right now while the market's down uh, I'm in it for the long term a lot of people were in it for the long term here Libby she's in it for the long term she's a she's a hodler so um, everybody uh, have a good night and uh, hopefully uh, we close out the last you know few hours the last hour here it's like four o'clock Eastern um, 
we maybe we'll close out the last couple hours of the work day here um in the green and have have a decent turnaround and we won't head any any lower like i said i don't want to see us dip any uh, any even below 9500 i'd start to get a little worried that we're going to go lower again before we start heading to new all-time highs but uh everybody have a good uh evening late afternoon here early evening and i'll give you guys another update later on tonight or tomorrow